Guys, this is Constantine, 350 backpacker, and right now I am in Ho Chi Minh or Saigon, Vietnam. And right now I'm staying in a hostel which is called, called Mobilet. Moby! Hey, Moby! It's located in the city center and it's not very big, but there are a lot of nice features that I'm going to show you today. Yeah, there are lots of tiny details here. By the way, I want to say that it was pretty easy for me to check in. It didn't take a lot of time. And uh, here at the reception, you have a cafe and uh, you can order some water or some coffee, which is super convenient. Even though there isn't a lot of space, but it's very easy to talk to people. And look at this cute bike. I don't know why they put it up there, but I don't know. It looks pretty nice. Then there is uh, the most challenging part where you have to go up the stairs. And there are five floors and no elevator, so it's gonna be pretty challenging. Cats, kids, the ascension. And here are the stairs, no elevator, so it could be a torture for someone with a huge luggage. And that's not who I am because I just have a small backpack. And then when we move to the rooftop bar, it's gonna be another challenge. I'm gonna show you the room. Okay, so before entering the room, I gotta do this, take off my shoes. So let's be polite. And the room is pretty small, but it's chill because there is AC working. There's also a shower in the room. There are curtains and I have this privileged lower bunk bed. I'm so lucky, it's the third time I've had this bunk bed probably at the bottom, but the light doesn't work. So I guess that's the price I pay for this. Yeah, the light doesn't work. I hope the electric, electrical outlet works here. Okay, so the outlet works, but the lamp doesn't work. But at least I've got this window so I can check who's going up and down the stairs. Okay, now I got it. Just because this lamp doesn't work, they installed this uh, lamp into this electrical outlet. So even though I have uh, fewer outlets here, only one, at least I have this light. Okay, it's not bad at all. Okay, look at this fancy sink. There's a shower here in the bathroom. I hope everything is working because somebody had just has just taken a shower. So I love this sink. Look at that. I'm just wondering where the water goes. There must be a hole somewhere hidden, but it takes a while for the floor to get dry. No elevator challenge accepted. Here we go. It wasn't that hard. Ah oh, no. Damn it, there is one more fly. And here we go. Wasn't so hard. And after climbing all the stairs, finally this uh, tiny rooftop bar, which is very small, but I guess cool for hanging out. That's what I'm gonna do tonight. I got a voucher for a free beer. I guess only one, not like in Hanoi, but okay, good for me. And the prices are really good, so I'm definitely eating tonight. Just a beef steak for 80,000. I think the price is pretty good, isn't it? I think at night it'll be not that hot here and the view will be better. So we'll see how it goes. We'll see how it goes. This is uh, what the city looks like at night. Maybe not the best observing observation point, but that's what we have here. And it's not bad at all for a hostel. Yeah, there are definitely more people right now, so you might be able to talk to people and drink some free beer. I said I don't drink beer anymore, but if it is for free, why not? Free beer, it's bottled local beer which is pretty decent yeah not bad i don't usually eat at night 
after after six, but I was so curious about the steak, which costs three point five dollars. So I was like, yeah, I gotta try this steak, right? What it looks like. We've got some steak. Let's see, steak, steak, steak. Oh yeah, the Douglas Sirk steak. And some eggs, which is not super healthy because they must be vegetables. But whatever, it's just three point five dollars, like eighty thousand, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, let's give it a try. Well, I can't say it's 100% tender, but it's edible, pretty much, pretty much. I should say I pretty much liked it. I did, I did. It wasn't bad, it wasn't bad, thank you very much. It wasn't bad, so, and I got some extra, extra dessert, which is great. Everyone is so excited about the upcoming game, uh, the finals, uh, Argentina versus France. The World Cup 2022 and uh, everyone is waiting, everyone is waiting patiently. Uh, we'll see how it goes. And the video keeps glitching, what the, f what the hell. Everyone is so excited. Sometimes you gotta leave such an interesting game for some more important things at night. Checked out from the hostel. It's early in the morning, 6:30, and I'm going to go to Cambodia by bus. And it was very nice of stuff to offer me free water. It's bottled water. On um, the checkout, which is awesome. So I slept only two hours, so I'll have to sleep on the bus. And in a nutshell, I enjoyed the hostel. It's not big, and it doesn't have an elevator, which is not a problem for me. Um, the rooftop bar was very nice and uh, the room and everything worked pretty much okay. So yeah, I can totally recommend this hostel. There wasn't anything bad that dissatisfied me and um, the staff was very nice, very polite. So yeah, um, I traveled to this hostel and uh, I'll see you guys very soon. Uh, the next review will be from Cambodia, Phnom Penh, and uh, we'll see how it goes there. See you guys, bye.